Greetings everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for rejoining me here in Kaiserreich, playing as the beautiful United States of America under Huey Long. So last time, we did a couple more focuses, we took up pretty much all of South America, <clears throat> Puerto Rico, as well as Africa. Almost all of Africa, which we saw the Republic of South Africa down here, but we need to do another focus, and then go to war with uh, Prussia. Yes, let's go ahead and come over here, and, you know, it's been a while since we've done this one, let's try, not that one though, Naval Training for better invasion preparation time and less and more amphibious invasion speed and more soft attack and hard attack for, for marines or expand the marine corps I'm gonna get more naval training well the naval academy in Annapolis was destroyed in the fighting in the Civil War we still have plenty of facilities able to train a new generation of naval leaders and sailors which would be a great great thing right now what do we have out of date? carrier hull, that's fine even though we could use a butt ton more chromium uh, who do I want to get chromium from? Uh, let's give him the Republic of South Africa for now just because we're going to get rid of them later, but I'm building up a lot of infrastructure everywhere. Tons of it. Even though we don't really need... Well, we can still be building up down here. That's actually kind of okay with me. Uh, convoy results. Uh, I'm using my carriers down here. My ships. A lot of Thai divisions and convoys being sent around here. People want to give me guns? Sure. I'm only out of 2.1 million. Uh, sure, why not? There you go. Now there's no problem. Set high to re upgrades. You can do that to medium. That's fine. Convoy's gone, convoy's gone. Uh, good, 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 good. You guys are down here guarding an entire line against these guys. Man, we're going to get blown back probably as soon as the war starts. So, let's go ahead and do this first. Half tracks, let's grab some more of that. We might make some mechanized divisions, maybe. Since we're trying to get all the way to Japan, we're just taking the long way around. Uh, let's see, what do we have over here? A lot of garbage planes. Strategic bombers, fighters. Those are pretty good. There we go. Duplicate. I love the duplicate button. I use it pretty often now. God dang it. Uh, that was my bad. Do that. And then do that. There we go. There we go. One, two, three, four. Uh, 400 for the tanks and motorize. Do that. And then we'll do another group for other divisions. Divisions to 1,000. Uh, I got 1,200 here, that's not bad. Right, Bink? I'm joining with my cat, Binky. She's on my bed, uh, just kind of sleeping on it. Not even biting my sheets, which is weird. Let's see, do we have any fighters? Naval bombers would be nice. Tactical bombers would be very nice. Actually, do we have any close air support, though? Uh, there wasn't too many comments from yesterday, but... Oh, that's a bit too many. Uh, someone just re recommended or talked or discussed or said that he was from Brazil. So he's wondering if, if I take him over... Would every man still be a king under him? And the question, or the answer to that question, probably is yes. As long as you want to be part of us, every man's a king. Now, if you don't want to be part of us, well, then we're going to run into issues. Some very serious issues. <laughs> cool. And also, I've set up my naval invasions to be ready to go and to invade uh, Turkey. So we'll see what happens. Especially since my land's pretty weak in some places, especially against Prussia. Eh, it's actually not too bad. It's not great. But with enough air superiority, we should do okay. And, yeah. I definitely I'm, want to use my tanks first to take out South Africa. That's what I'm waiting for. I want to get the justification done for South Africa first before we do anything else. So, uh, we still have quite a few days left. Naval mine laying, that's great. Hydrophones. Uh, yeah, do this one. Shell dies, that'd be good. Cancel Lund lease. And, of course, we can still go to war by July 9th. So, still got another month. I want to go to war with these guys first so we can finish off Africa completely. And then go to war with the Chiropact and have our tanks and an extra army to help defend and push and do all the normal good stuff. In the meantime, though, uh, naval stuff. Let's see. Escort cruisers, very good. Throw them in the middle. You three, come right here. A truly great navy. One of the best in the world, if not the best. Of course, that is my opinion, and it's totally not biased. Totally. Could get some mountaineers. That actually would be probably pretty beneficial. Uh, armor. I was thinking about using SP artillery, but I'm thinking, eh, it's kind of, it's okay to use. It's not great. It's just kind of okay. Uh, air stuff. Yeah, we should probably get better close air support first. And we should go to war very, very soon as we destroy more Japanese convoys. Oh, Angola. I love Angola. As, also, I think, yeah, Japan's at war with China. Yeah, I think that that's the case, yeah. Let's see. Um, where do I... What you guys? Well, I could put one of you guys, the Washington Division, right there. 
Extra divisions. Can I make you marines as well? Why not? Aerial mine laying? Sure. Why not? Oh yeah, we got better carriers or something here. Ah, mechanized equipment. Great. Yes, make plenty of mechanized equipment. Oh, we're out of steel. That is not good. What do we have over here? Return, return to Egyptian lands. I think we're okay. I think we're okay, man. I think we're okay. Can I convert you to marine as well? That'd be so cool. There you go. Um, I think we're pretty much done making divisions then. Cool. I don't need that many more marines. How many can I make? Uh, literally just one more. That's fine. Bing bing, you okay? Now you're off my bed. All right. All right, come on, justification, get done, get done. Rippy bink. Twelve days. That's kind of fine. Uh, we can go ahead and go to war then. That's fine. Let's see what happens. Now I, I bet they're gonna immediately attack us somewhere, or maybe not. Shell dies. Very cool. So we're gonna get some naval mine damage, even though we're never gonna be using that probably. Ooh, we actually lost a few planes because of the ah, things right there. All right. So be it. And he, my cat is sniffing around a box. Okay, well, have fun with that. Now, we're not going to fight them yet. Obviously, we need to call our allies into the war, but I kind of want to wait until South Africa gets involved. I really kind of do. Ah, uh, Semper Five. Yes, please. Semper Fidelis means always loyal. The Marine Corps should always be a bastion of American liberty and democracy and help spread these freedoms around the world. Uh, if expand the Marine Corps if is chosen. So we don't get more special forces, but if we chose this one, which we did for naval training, get more soft attack and hard attack, which is actually very cool. Hey, get another convoy. Hey, three more subs have sunk. How big is the Russian Navy before we utterly kill it? Oh, please just give me one moment. It's actually not small at all. Wow. Hi, baby. <clears throat> and my cat has escaped my room. Okay, we're fighting India too. All right, whatever. I don't really care. That's a big old Russian Navy. A lot bigger than I thought. But you know what? They might have a bigger navy than us, but quality is what matters. Uh, you're looking pretty th thin there, boy. You need some extra strength. Hey, look at that. Using our carrier fleet, we just sunk t task, task force. I cannot think right again. My brain go go dead. What the heck, brain? Um, where's the best place to, to defend? It might be this group down here. Maybe, maybe not. I might call, you know what, let's call the Greeks. As you can tell, oh wait, hold on. Yeah, she, she was called in. I have liberated Greece, Yugoslavia. I didn't tell you guys about that, but basically, I gave him Slovenia. I even gave him Albania, even though it doesn't make that much sense. I just prefer it like that, so that it reduces lag, like I said before. It makes it look a little nicer. Greece is honestly looking like a pretty much like our modern Greece, so it is what it is. Oh, uh, we lost a sub. Let's go ahead and get some technology. Cancel the lend lease. That's not cool, man. Uh, yeah, do that. And since we're here, since we got a little bit of time, right? Nothing says nuclear like a nuclear reactors in Texas. Cool. Ah, uh, keep sinking them submarinos. And I'm gonna call them the Greeks. Ah, uh, they're actually gonna take over our islands. Mm, maybe not the Greeks. Mm, over here, probably not these guys either. What? Hmm. Two, 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 one, one, one. Yeah, let's call them this group. Uh, well then, uh, Yugoslavia maybe. You know, let's call it Yugoslavia. Hey, there we go. Let's get the ball rolling here. Now they're going to be attacking us, which is a bad idea. Hey, touch on some planes. Good. Good, we got some carrier protection. We're shooting down quite a few enemy planes there. Go ahead and go to war with these guys so we can finish these guys off more quickly. Are they just... Oh, there's just tanks down here. Yeah, we got to get these things finished. Uh, please come uh, to arms. You really don't have a say in this, but whatever. Called in Afghanistan. We're kind of losing in some places here. Well, well hold on. No, I was think it's good because because of air power. Maybe we should have enough air power. And I'm a little concerned that they are trying to hit my ships. So I might pull out of here for now. Yeah, let's go ahead and pull out of here because I don't like how close I am to the continent. So let's go over there. And there, there you go. That's maybe a little easier for us. Go ahead and repair. I don't want to lose any ships, you know. I'm very careful with my ships, so. And I'm not too worried about what happens down there. In South Africa, if the tanks can't do it, then we've got a serious problem. And they are some god-dang-blessed tanks. I swear to God. 
that are amazing. Even India has some heavy tanks? Light tank brigades. Okay. Oh, good job, India. Good job. Mm, Bulgaria. I guess we could call it Bulgarian as well. Gotta love a divided Bulgaria. We we're here to reunite your homeland, Bulgaria. Just remember that. Your homeland. Ah, uh, they got some mechanized to see, huh? Now, hopefully we can destroy the enemy's air force. Because I just want to rip it all to shreds. All of it to shreds. Oh, you guys are doing great. Love it. Cape down, please. You come over to Port Elizabeth. And East London. Uh, oh, you should be able to get there even faster. Nice. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, we lost a convoy. That's not good. Why'd they stop attacking? What the heck? Oh, guys, why'd you stop? War propaganda? Well, we don't really need it. Hmm. How is it? Ah, yes. The Republic of South Africa, thank you for joining us here. We're gonna take all states immediately. And I'll basically just piecemeal it to Angola. Uh, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to, like, do this with everything here. I'm just gonna have to give it as course because I don't want them to release it. That's what I normally do when stuff like this happens. Swaziland. Thank you. Good. 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 Western Cape. Eastern Cape. Cool. And then... I love my African puppets. Oh, that was the last one. Orange Free State. And then we have the Sotho. Very weird. Very cool, though. Very cool. Look at that. That's nice. That's really nice. One, two, three, four. And that's all done. Now we're going to send our tanks up here. And we're probably not going to take out the Persians. We might just take out the Turks first. Eh, maybe the Persians. I don't know. What was it like down here? This is part of Kurdistan. Mm, Kurdistan, huh? Well, the Kurds don't have Kurdistan, but that makes sense, I guess. We do something like that. I guess we're going to push into Persia. Maybe cut them off. And focus on Turkey and Russia down here. Alright, so be it. Whatever. Air bases. We might need some more. Depending on what happens. Seriously, they stopped attacking? Why? Hmm. Don't really want to navally invade yet. What's going on down here? Cool. Some more submarinos? Good. Mm hmm. Good. Keep taking the Russian ships. More subs are gone. More subs are gone. More subs are gone, or destroyers. And then more subs go bye bye. And two destroyers, and then two more destroyers, and then a little task force. Half task force, maybe. Oh, they are attacking us again. Great. Love it. Now, I will attack. I don't want to attack yet, just because air superiority isn't in our favor for a chunk of this. So, we gotta get more planes. 800. Don't mind if I do. And it's all the way down here. Cool. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Right there. Five, six, seven, eight. Throw them right there. At the very least, we should have air superiority for everything, so. And who's defending this line? So these two over here, these two guys. No, that's the case. Not bad. Get some more fighters. Nice. Cool. <clears throat> oh no, someone shut down and we lost him. That's not good. Get rid of that group. That's fine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Tons of fighters. So many fighters. Love the fighters. Look at that. We lost two in exchange for 24. I like that. Shot down 12 or sunk 12. Very good. And they're still attacking us in some places, which is nice. Losses thus far 26,000. No, that's China. We lost 100,000. That's actually quite a few. That's a lot more than I thought we would have lost already. That's okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, then again, it is to mostly Russia, not even Japan. Sent for five. Nice. Oh, this is. Just a war somewhere between us and... Oh, we've lost no one against Japan, I guess. 
We've killed off 45,000 of them. I see Russian Republic, we've killed off over almost a quarter million of them. So not bad. Let's see. Mm, America rules the waves. At least 350 ships. That's so many ships. Look at this one, though. Battle cruisers present a middle balance between heavy battleships and faster cruisers. We should ensure that we have some in our navy. Good idea. Um, how's this looking? I'm not sure why we don't have air superiority here, but whatever. Alright, whatever. Are the tanks up here yet? No, I really want the tanks, because then we'll start moving from there. Cool. If we lose that tile, you know, whatever. If we back up, that just makes it easier for, easier for us to defend anyway, so. Hey, look. Not nice. Very nice. Okay, why are they attacking with militia divisions? Of all things to attack with. That's a bit insane. So we call it in this group, which is fine. We call them Bulgarians, which is fine. I don't want to call them the Greeks yet. Or the Kurds, but we'll call them the Kurds very soon. Or not Kurds, but you know, Arabians. Come on, guys, get down here. Oh boy, lost another... Eh, kind of an allied convoy, but whatever. Oh yeah, they're still attacking us, which is nice. It's very, very nice. They've lost half a million already. Jesus Christ, guys, what the heck. Oh, I guess I was doing that for the Queen government. Okay, cool. They got a ton of planes, but even with double the amount of planes, they still can do that well against us. Cool. Middle guy, you do you need more fighters? I mean, that's fine with me. <clears throat> Finally, a worthy opponent. Even though it looks like we're probably going to need more fighters later on, too. How many planes does Russia actually have? Let's see. They have a butt-ton of planes. Tons of tons and tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of planes. So that's the case. That's okay. We'll make more uh, things like this. Uh, yeah, actually, uh, we were to five, so I'm not really using it. I'm going to keep you on for now, but we'll see what happens. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Very good. Very, very good. Oh, can I build radar up here? That'd be nice. We have some radar down here, which is okay. Nowhere else, though. That really kind of sucks. Well, okay, so you're taking quite a few hits. It is what it is, but, you know, whatever. Uh, oh. Well, we lost a sub already. Doesn't look like we're really hurting them with that. Uh, if that's the case, can throw some naval bombers down here, maybe? Strategic bombers, not bad. The naval bombers are near close to the bottom. Cool. Very nice. And, well, I think the tanks are here. That's good. And, actually, Kurdistan, are you... You're indep You're completely independent. Huh. I never knew that. I don't like that. Could you end up going to town on these guys right now? If we call these guys in. Which would probably be a bad idea, but we'll do it anyways. You should be able to do this and move quickly because they're beating us up. In several different locations. You know what? We're gonna do this. I need you on this part of the line, and I need you all focused here. That's what we have to do. Because we can win probably using just using these tanks. <clears throat> They're not bad. Hmm. Oh boy, losing a couple subs here and there. That's not good. We, lost, we sunk a sub. We sunk some more ships. Good. We're going to lose more subs. But with these extra planes here, we'll do okay. Oh, look at that. More convoys getting sunk. I love it. <clears throat> oh, we're down here too. That's not good. Hey, three cruisers. Nice. Nice stuff. That's not too bad then. Not bad. Nice. They lost two battleships. Very good. They lost a battleship. Nice. Awesome stuff. Awesome stuff. Oh. Look at those ships getting sunk. Love it. And convoys. Four more destroyers. Three more escort cruisers. <clears throat> Very nice. Now, could you guys move through here? You might be able to. 
Wow. What happened to my voice? Ooh. <clears throat> cool. And my voice is back. To normal. Hopefully. Could you guys actually win here? Uh, yes, yeah, sort of. No, yes. Uh, Lepo's gonna be a pain in the butt to take out. I don't think we could actually really win here, but... Yeah, get those Russians out of there. Russians should not be in Aleppo. Then again, you can make the case that Americans shouldn't be in Aleppo too, but you know... It is what it is. We're gonna lose quite a few guys doing this, but that's okay, whatever. Dude, bombers... Hey, look! Passport's down here, nice. Nice. Any others? Oh, yeah. Convoys. What happened here? A couple more ships. A couple more ships. I mean, I love these tanks, man. Even in mountains. When they're fighting 3v12. Now, it's going to ruin our tanks, but... I, that's why I want to attack through Turkey. Alright, I'm going to call everyone in now. See what happens. Probably a really bad idea, but whatever. Let the Marines go as well. We lost a sub in exchange for a couple convoys. Not great, but whatever. I mean, look at those tanks go. I mean, Jesus Christ, that's amazing. Even when they're taking attrition and stuff like that, it's so awesome. Large subs? Well, I can start doing some of this stuff, I guess. The casualties are probably about 300,000. About so. They've already lost over 3 million, which is awesome. Alright, guys, good luck. Really good luck. Let's see what you can do. Enough air superiority, you should do okay, but let's see what happens. Good. It's going to grab expand the Army Ranger Corps. So, uh, Fort Benning, George has been home to some of the most resourceful soldiers of the early stages of the Civil War. Training regiments acclimatized, acclimatized the soldiers into new environments will enable American soldiers to survive in the hostile world we find ourselves in. Oh, I'm going to take so many losses on the advancing front, and it looks like we've been navally invaded in the back, which is not ideal. Mm, I don't really have anyone to spare, so you guys are going to come over here. If we could get into the Sudetenland, that would be great. Uh, obviously, we don't have enough organization for our soldiers, just because we went down mobile warfare, but it is what it is. Uh, we're actually pushing into Turkey, even though we're taking horrendous losses right now, I bet. So, Alright, so tanks, you guys are going to hold on. Um, yeah, you guys stop attacking. We have enough supplies to hold on for a while. Just gonna park it. Park it. I said park it. Park the god dang thing. Just kinda hold for now. That's all I want. Hold. Uh, help out the supplies too around here. Uh, it's not looking very good. I've gotta wait till we take out more of Turkey first. Uh, not bad, not bad so far. Kill these guys off. Take one, go that way. Take another one, go there. And there. Good. Not bad. Could have been worse so far. Couch is 400,000. Half a million, wow. That's a lot of losses. We're gonna get how many a month? 21,000? That's not bad. Slowly pushing into every location, though. I took the really long way to try to get around to Japan. Woo! Not sure why they went really went to war with me, though. Like, they haven't done anything since they really went to war. I mean, they already took out Hawaii earlier. Hey, look! Our naval invasion actually worked. Could I actually send you... Oh, Fengshin government's gone. Um, wait, I was at war with the Fengshin government? Um, I don't think I was. But okay. Gotta love coffee. Alright, I'm gonna give this mostly to the Queen government, so... There you go. I'm not sure what to do with all the score, so there you go. That looks really bad. I really have no idea what to do with them, and I don't want to give it to Japan, so... There you go. Good luck. Not bad. Hey, look at that. Nice. Good stuff. Good stuff. Are you guys not attacking? Uh, well, that makes some sense, I guess. Did you actually win here? Looks like maybe, but probably not. How's their superiority? With all of our planes in the air, then we get air superiority. We all attack at the same time. 
nice. Oh, we almost have all of Bulgaria under us. Nice, good. Save the Bulgarians. Oh, the fight in Turkey here has been hellacious, to say the very least. Yeah, we're going to lose at least a million soldiers fighting the Russians. It is what it is, though. We wouldn't want it any other way, right? Good. How many have they lost? Like, almost four and a half million? Not bad. Not bad at all. So we got Marines there. That's fine. I'm going to take the Marines out of here, because we don't really need them here. One, two, three. I'm going to make sure we get over here and that we push very adequately. Because they're running out of soldiers to move around, which is a nice, nice, nice thing. Oh, let's get Constantinople. I don't know why it's called Constantinople. Well, I guess it's called that just because Russia did take over Turkey. So that actually does make some sense. They'd probably rename the city and still give it to them, maybe. Or give them some autonomy with it. I don't know. Uh, war propaganda extraction. We might as well, because you know, it doesn't matter at all. Anything still left here? Oh, yeah, banshees. Well, might as well be better close to the support, right? There you go. Not bad. Pretty good. Pretty darn good. Nice stuff. I don't think we're going to make it to Moscow by the end of this video, but I could be wrong. I could be very, very wrong. Taking, we've already taken a million casualties at the very least. Wow, that's a lot. But then again, when you're on attack, what do you expect, you know? Keep going, guys. Keep going. Where we are going, they're going to suffer probably at least 10 million. Oh, we actually lost a sub. That's not good. Hmm, that's not good. Well, well keep thinking stuff. The fall of Bucharest? Great. We will return. What? We will return. Why do we return? We just entered the city. Look at all the ships getting sunk. I love it. Are they attacking my tanks at all? Which is not suffering from supply issues at all, which is awesome. I really should have another infantry army, but whatever. It is what it is. We'll make do with what we got. So, next up. This will defend. Our new army has adapted the old model by, using, by our forefathers who took up arms to defend our great nation. Like them before our team. Now it is time for us to fight for America in the ever-changing world, be it at home or abroad. Yes, we're, we're definitely doing stuff abroad, to say the very least. Ah, Romania. Slowly falling apart. They've only lost 5 million. That's not enough. God, I wish my puppets would make more divisions, but whatever. Alright, air superiority watch. Excuse me. Here? Looking okay, not great. Who's on this front? Ah, Simpson. Hmm. Actually, can I just like click on his planes? Oh, I can't duplicate them, huh? Stockpile of matching? Huh. Whatever. Thought maybe I could do that, but whatever. Don't tell me we're out of fighters already. Oh crap, are we out of we're out of fighters. Holy crap. Yep, we're out of fighters. Alright everyone. It's time to do what America does best. And produce. You can lower by five by ten tanks there, that's fine. Um lower by five, that'd be fine. Anything else down here? Oh yeah. There you go. But more naval bombers, that'd be fine. Uh, advanced anti-air. Yeah, we'll get there eventually, maybe. See what happens. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Make more fighters if we can. Yes. I'll take all your planes. I'll do that, that's fine. Get some better light ship holes, that'd be good. Good, good, good. Where happened to the army down here? Oh, he came back up here, that's fine, whatever. Port stuff. Sometimes we lose a couple guys here and there. Alright, Marines, it's your time to shine. Come on out. Oh, yeah, I love having allies. Go, if you go. Tearing apart. Ah, at least we got through the mount some of the mountainous regions here in Czechoslovakia or Czechia. Czechia. Alright, so these guys, the Prussians. Can they continue the fighting? No, they cannot. They're out of manpower. That's great. 621 divisions, Czechia. They're out of manpower as well. Uh, Romania is out of manpower as well. As well, how about Hungary? No, they got a little bit left. And Moscow has half a million. Turkey has no manpower. We've literally taken so many losses, and they've taken so many losses that they've run out of manpower already. I love it. Very good. 
You know, this keeps it up. We'll destroy all Russian manpower and basically could very well end up being in Moscow by the end of this video. I really doubt it, but we'll see what happens. We've taken so many losses, a horrendous amount. I might just end up coring some of these states here because it's been a while since we've actually taken them over. It's over 48. And some places, probably in Canada, would rather be American than you know, places like Brazil. But hey, you never know. Uh, we haven't killed enough here yet, though. Only 5.49. Not enough. But, hey, we're actually seeking stuff over there, which is kind of crazy to think about, but okay. Is this Cass? It is Cass. Nice. Nice. I mean, they're out of manpower. I mean, oh my god. Look at Romania. They just gave up. Beautiful. We linked up with some of the Marines. Great job, guys. Great job. Hey, another Marine division. Great. Uh, let me see. You can make not one more, which sucks, but whatever. Th these are motorized? Um, I want to say that these are not motorized. Mechanized. 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 I'm going to make them 40 combat with. Uh, let's see. If I use motorized infantry, their armor is going to go down by a little bit. If I use motorized artillery, their armor is still going to go down, but by the same amount. Truck drawn rocket artillery. That just gives you a flat more amount. I'd rather have just, like, straight up more armor, I guess. I mean, yeah, we could get, like, a lot more. But with mechanized, it increases by 19, which is, like, 10... Roughly 10 less than using motorized rocket artillery. Just motorized artillery, so... This is not going to be too bad. That's going to be not bad at all. Organization is high. H uh, organization is very high. HP isn't bad either. Engineers is going to hurt our armor a little bit, but whatever. Um, Anti-tank, support artillery. We're going to actually throw on light tank armored cards to help us out. Better logistics because we need that maintenance companies as well. And then... Uh, this wouldn't hurt too bad. Actually. Well, since we have support artillery made and fully researched, is better than support rocket artillery for now. Uh, do that one. That's fine. I might actually convert some of these infantry divisions immediately. Like, how about you? You're looking at... Oh my shnikes! You are just killing yourself on the line. Please don't do that. For the love of God, please don't do that. Holy crud. Uh, I'm going to convert you guys immediately to motorized. You know, it's mechanized. Because at least this way, you can get enough supplies. I mean, you're almost at the exact strength, strength levels as you were earlier, so... Should be pretty speedy, too. Hopefully. And we can't pierce the enemies yet, which sucks, but whatever. Turkey's going to fall, hopefully, very soon. Oh my goodness, what do you guys need? So much. Please do not fight until you die. Please, for the love of God, do not do that. Don't let them leak back up. Come on. Good. At least this is looking pretty good down here. Uh, Romania, Hungary is going to be kind of a bigger problem. You should actually be able to take these guys out with little to no effort, to be honest with you. Yeah, keep it up. Soldiers everywhere are dying like crazy, so you guys got to keep doing that too. Even though we've lost too many guys, but it is, it is what it is. Let's see, we're done with that, we're done with that, we're done with this, we're done with this. Are we done with the focus tree already? No! We're only 11 episodes in, we need more focus tree. <laughs> Uh, in the meantime, let's go ahead and do some construction engineering and maybe do some suppression. That'd probably be fine. Good job, guys. You're doing a phenomenal job. Yeah, we're doing actually really well in Turkey. I like it. I like it a lot. Improve infrastructure, improve infrastructure, inf infrastructure. Maybe get another air base. How's radar looking? Uh, it's looking okay, actually. If we need to, we can put one in Odessa as well. That'd be fine. Ah, uh, we have lost another division. We lost, actually, yeah, one division. That's not good. Uh, let's see. America's finest. That's fine. Wow, they attacked until they died. Jesus Christ, guys. Please. Like, I get it. You want to attack until you die, but please don't. <laughs> please. I mean, I, I had to keep attacking so we can keep up the losses, which keeps us our lo which keeps us keeps our losses up as well, which I don't like. I'm not really sure how they can keep defending against me like this, though, with literally no manpower. That doesn't make any sense. And then again, our strength is not that high, so we might as well stop attacking right for now, then. Uh, just repair yourselves. Help yourselves out. <clears throat> you know what? Convert six of these guys to motorize. See what we can do. Does that hurt our deficit? Oh, we're out of fighters, too. That is not good. Yeah, we've, we've done really well in this area. Like, this is ridiculously... Just done amazing. 
Oh, they've lost more guys. We lost two million probably so far. Yeah, about two million. What I kind of expected. All right, guys, you gotta hurry up. We gotta finish off Turkey now. Marines, I love you guys, but you gotta help out as well. You gotta go immediately. Uh, how are you dead already? Just attack that way. Cut them off. Thank you. Cut these guys off. That'd be great. Now kill these guys off too. Please attack my tanks. Please. Sweden sent volunteers to Russia. Really? Wow. Romania's almost a memory now. That's good. Come on, Hungary. Capitulate. Oh, they're attacking us in Prussia now. Huh? Armored cars. Fine. Mechanized. Looking pretty good. Oh, they're trying to push us out now, huh? I see. Hey, tr finally, Turkey's gone. Clean this up, clean this up, so we can start fighting through the Caucasus and take away their oil supplies. Well, some of their oil supplies. In the, eh, what? It's so American. Need more oil. Go do that. Hey, Prussia, nice. We can go to war with those guys too. Uh, not bad, not bad. Hey, another armored tank. Actually. These tanks, how are they doing? We have enough modern tanks. We might actually start converting some more of these guys over. Yeah, we're still using some medium tanks, which is, eh, could be worse, but whatever. There you go. Much better, right? Cool. Very good. Come on, come on, come on. Man, Hungary is such a battlefield right now. Trying to get Budapest is a pain in the butt. Jesus Christ. I wish our reinforcement was better. They're really trying to attack us and kill us off here. They've taken 2 million. They've taken 7. That's not enough. That's straight up not enough. Alright, Marines, you're done, but not really. I need you to take out Kurdistan. You need to go to war by when? March 16th, which would be fine. You just go right on ahead if you can. Are right, you guys... You're just sitting there doing nothing. Pretty much. Come on. Move. 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 Stop wasting time. We have to get rid of these guys. Oh, and they're attacking our tanks again. Which, actually, at this point, I'm going to attack them again with my tanks. We've had more than enough time to plan out, and these tanks are just too good to not use. B24 Liberators. Cool. Good. 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 Who dares wins? Strategic Bombers. Very good. Could use more aluminum right now. Uh, France. Kingdom of Greece. I'll oh, do Greece. Why not? i only do one of them. That'd be fine. Who dares wins? Cool. All you guys come here. Kill these guys off. Keep them in place. Jesus Christ. Russia's got to be out of manpower now. They have to be. There's no explanation of how they could not be out of manpower at this point. They're super close. Okay, that makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Poland's out. All these guys are out. Except for maybe Czechia. India, of course, has a god-awful amount of manpower, so... Uh, yeah, keep trying to attack me, see what happens. Yep, they can beat us in some locations, which is fine. Hurry the hell up around here. Seriously. Do they have a port? They have no port. They should not be getting any supplies. How are they getting supplies? Maybe they have, like, supply bonus, maybe? But I really doubt it. I really doubt it here. Alright, Marines, we gotta hurry this up. Get in, get in. Actually, can I get... Garrison support from our soldiers? Uh, France. They probably have no manpower. Yes. Yes, good. How do you guys not have enough garrisons? How can you not do that? 51,000. Uh, Persia is gone. Good. Oh, we're going to tear up all the enemy, enemy nations down there. Algeria. No, don't give me this crap that you don't have enough. You have more than enough manpower. Yeah, these people... that They should not honestly not be able to do that. Doesn't have enough manpower to give us? Really? Really? Yeah, I don't know about that. I really don't know about that, man. 
But good job with the tanks. I mean, this is, this is awesome. Kill them all straight up. Let's get rid of them. Look at that. Beautiful. See, we're sitting in the Marines. They know how to take out the enemy, even though Kurdistan probably wasn't the most difficult enemy to take out. Just fine with me. Uh, you guys, help take these guys out over here. Because infantry seem to take forever to deal with that stuff. Uh, let's see. We're slowly getting better mechanized, which is probably not a good thing to convert them in the middle of a war, but whatever. Kurdistan, thank you very much. Nice. Very good. Uh, no, no, no. We've almost lost three million. Jesus Christ. Come on. I mean, at this, at some point, you gotta ask yourself, how? Why? Like, this doesn't make any sense. Uh, I'm actually gonna send you guys here, though, to help defend. Just because I need to send my tanks somewhere else. Oh, so somewhere else? I mean Europe. I'm gonna smash the hell out of these enemies in Europe. Uh, actually, first of all, I'm gonna make these guys go up here first so we can consolidate the line a little better and then I'll send them over here I'm gonna maybe I could try to link up to the Ukraine because the infantry is doing a, just an amazing job good, good Russia I don't understand how are you getting more manpower you don't all don't serve but you're out of manpower already Russia you're about to lose a lot of fuel yep they've already lost Baku you know what maybe I want some to Europe actually technically we already uh, are we in some? Yeah, this is still Eurasia, technically. Yeah, fight it down here. Good. Marines, do your best. And please make it to the line in time. So it doesn't look like we're going to be able to get to Moscow by the end of this video, which I didn't think we would actually be able to do. But it is what it is. Go ahead and stop attacking, guys. You guys, go ahead and stop attacking. Stop attacking crossing the entire front for now. Okay, Hungary is gone as well. Uh, you know what? Keep going then. Good. Very good. Actually, do we have everyone here? Sort of, not really. I'm gonna go and do this though. Advanced light ships? Uh, maybe, but just do convoys at this point. I think we'll be okay. Got another enemy lost and defeated. 19 more ships. Got three more carriers. God dang. Put them all right there. That's fine. Let's go cruises. Put them all right there because we're gonna need them. Uh, do that. Too. There you go. Not bad. Pretty good. They're still trying to attack us. Love it. Let them try as we're slowly creeping up around behind them. Oh yeah, now now we're done here. So cool. Now we're gonna take a couple hits here. That's okay. Persia, Afghanistan, that area is all a distraction. We're gonna have one massive front line here. Then we'll be able to go and wreak havoc on the enemy. Because over here, they, the enemies can't do anything. Not against these tanks. There's just not enough divisions around to help stop them. Good, good. Ah, I love bringing liberty to these nations. Now, we might have to do a small little retreat just because we don't have enough divisions to help hold the line. It's fine. It's whatever it is. Actually, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and do that. Just so we have a nice, good fallback line. Uh, we're going to defend Tran. You guys get over here. There we go. That's a little better. Consolidate our forces a little bit more. Um, there you go. There we go. The tanks, I mean, eventually the enemy will realize, oh, maybe we should move our line a little bit. But that's okay. Lost 3 million. Ish. They've lost 10 million. I knew they lose at least 10 million. It's not enough, though. It's not enough for them. Yugoslavia. Hmm. No. Greece. No. Hmm. Well, the mechanizer is looking better. That's good. Uh, what do we have here? Oh, Fate of Kurdistan. Oh, we might as well do this right now. Let's see a change to a mod. Uh, I think Kurdistan, was that? Yeah. Let's give it to Arabia for now. I might switch this up later, depending on what we do. We'll see what happens. Are you guys still moving around? Yes, they are. The tanks are just... So good. Do we have Russia done? We do have Russia done, huh? Prussia's done, too. But I'm going to wait till we have more cryptology done. This is not good since we have an open hole here. I could sacrifice the this side. You know what? I'm going to attack Rush from two sides. Here's what we're going to do. I almost don't. We're done with this too? Oh, god dang. Air stuff. There you go. Okay, so tanks, you're doing a great job. But we really need to focus right here. We're going to try to make a break for it right here. 
We're gonna circle all these guys here and kill them off. We're gonna sacrifice the eastern portion of this in exchange for linking up and destroying enemy divisions. That is the goal. Oh, they're still trying to attack us, huh? I mean, if you want to be distracted by that, go right ahead, guys. I mean, whatever. We're still trying to get to the line, which is fine, but we are blitzing across here. Keep going, keep going, keep going. And then we're going to try a massive attack across the entire front line, if possible. Uh, were we missing anything else besides manpower and fighters? That's fine, that's fine. Even they can't keep this up either, so... Yes, please. Good, 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 good. Oh, oh my goodness. We're just... Oh my... We're... Oh, I'm not sure what to say anymore. We're slowly trying to get to the front line. Alright, give it a few more seconds and we're going to attack. It's going to be one of the costliest attacks we've ever done in his human history. Prussia, though... Russian Republic, let's go. Let's go, boys. You are gonna make it over here. Cut all these guys off. Alright, good. And then you guys come over here too. You know what? I didn't I said we weren't gonna make it to Moscow. Well, Let's try it. Yeah, a lot of these attacks aren't going very well. That's okay. If we can... We've almost... We cut them off. Cut them off. Just... Oh, someone capitulated. Check Kia. Oh, good. Good, 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 good. Hmm... we we'll probably need... We already have Queen Government. That's good. Follow Moscow. You know what? I guess I lied. We got it. Well, let's get them all off then. And watch what happens. And it, it, just an atrocious amount of losses. Atrocious. You just go up. Just go straight up. Now that those Chekia divisions are gone, they're pretty much kind of sunk. Good. So in the next episode, we're going to finish these guys off. As well as probably take up portions of China. Probably. That's probably what's going to have to happen. And then we'll invade Japan. Japan will be last. Which almost happens in so many of my campaigns. I always take them out last. It is what it is. Uh, have we have been cut off yet? Not yet. As we're just desperately trying to get to Petrograd. We might lose that tank division. But oh, can we get a battery? Please, 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 please. Come on. Keep going, guys. You're doing a great job. Yes, adaptable. Yes, I love adaptable. It's one of the best traits, I think, in my, in my opinion. Not bad. We've lost 3.18. That makes sense. Come on, kill these guys off. Come on. If you have to attack, attack somewhere that's decent. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. How are the tanks doing? We've been cut off, unfortunately. They're going to take back Moscow. What? Come on, hurry up. Hurry the hell up. Why are you stopping? You don't need an organization where you're going. Follow Petro... Petrograd, great. Now, I want you guys to get down here. You're going to make one trip to Riga, and then Königsberg to see what happens. And honestly, Poland, I'm not sure how you're doing fighting with no bodies. Oh, you got, two, you got a few bodies. Prussia, Russia, all these countries are out of bodies. Almost all, all out. Uh, let's see. I'm going to take one division come here. Sevastopol, very good, very good. They took back Ostrakhan, to a degree, yes, yes, yes I have. White Ruthenia, well, let's see if we can beat them up too. I forgot, okay, so Marines here, they're out of manpower. Good, you guys, continue doing a good job around here at this point. I should have made some mountaineers, but whatever. There you go. Dig in. These guys have done a tremendous job. Truly tremendous job. Pavlograd. I'm going to have you guys just go right there. That'd be good. And then we'll episode, end the episode once these guys are gone. Beautiful. Now they're stuck and they're dead. Cool. Well, I'm going to end the episode here, guys. We we did make it to Moscow. We lost it. But we did, did take a Petrograd. So, hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow when we finish Russia, finish up Russia and begin attacking China. And hopefully, maybe even Japan. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.